Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. My name is Mikey Dubs, and today we are continuing the Roguelands Gauntlet, which last episode we did some Krieg, and it wasn't the best uh, experience in the world, but here, Gage, we are here to continue on with Gage. She's hopefully her and Death Trap together combined, the duo, uh, can help me out, because I, as, as Krieg, I was taking a lot of damage, and when I was actually going for the melee hits, I felt like, I don't know. I wasn't oh my gosh look at these transfusions what um i felt like i just i wasn't pumping i was wasn't pumping up the actual deeps to the tougher enemy so i wanted a character that can maybe stack up and i was thinking about maybe shamelessly shamelessly resetting the starting room until i got a jacob shotgun mm, i'm undecided i think i might the starting room, does it, the starting room actually give you one of each type every time or no? Jacob's magazine size plus 46%. It could go crazy. It could get stupid. Let's see. Bouncing Betty. How about a slag bouncing Betty? That sounds good. Make sure we're shielded up and we can head on out. Launcher. Sniper rifle. Of course, it's a melee shield, but it is what it is. It'd be good for Death Trap if I could put him on him right away, but I can't. All right, a dart. It's corrosive, so we take it. I just don't think these hand cans are going to be what we're looking for. Come on, Jacob shotgun. Give me a coach gun. Yeah, coach gun. Oh, yeah. No coach gun, but we do get an iron. That's a, I think that's pretty high damage for Jacob's pistol. Put that in the one slot. Now they increase Jacob's magazine size, so that's gonna be pretty sick. Now I'm not gonna be able to stack up my anarchy until I get anarchy after this round, but it is what it is. Uh, yeah, if I can get a, if I can get an orphan maker, says Lugia in chat. Shout out to Lugia. If I get an orphan maker, it's GG, 100%. Sergeant loader deflecting my bullets or something. I think this gun could get it down as long as I can start hitting some crits or something. You're gone. Oh, that's a that's a nice enemy to take down. Let's go. Red City. Give him death trap. Oh, wait till I get anarchy and a Jacob shotgun. Oh my gosh. He was so over for you. I can cover. Go for damage. Don't kill that guy actually. I'm dead. I made a fatal mistake. All right, I'm a Jacob's girl in a Jacob's world. It's fantastic. I made a plastic. Oh, what's my, uh, let's, let's, let's go for a rubberized slide transfusion. Bye. I could get a Jack of all trades class upon. That'd be great too for more sorryful stuff going on. These, what, what, transfusion, you're supposed to be great at slagging. Here we go. Oh, I didn't even know you could get, take cover back here. This is as a game changer. This becomes a much safer zone to fight in. So what is this? Bandit? Nope. What I would like is a coach gun or a quad. Bushwhack. Oh, how about a Kazar? It costs, it costs some havoc. Go ahead. On your reinforcements. You're gonna get yoinked in by that Kazar. Yeah, it's over. It's over for you. It's over for you. Alright, let's see. Take up Shotty on a small map. Let's see. Come on. Did I already check this? I don't think I did. Well, not right is fantastic fantastic that could be one that we even use in like a dragon fight great 
long ways away. But here we go. Got ourselves a scatter gun. Which isn't a number one option for us, but actually, <laughs> you know, what we could totally do is we can get 150 stacks. Shotgun max ammo. Sniper rifle max ammo. Oh my gosh, we're one of the moon. Okay, okay. Here's what we do. What do we do? We put on the shotgun max ammo relic. We... Spec anarchy. Max, uh, spec smart letter faster. We take off this relic. Uh, no, I'm sorry. We don't want the Jacobs. We don't want this relic on. So we're good. And we can run over here. And we can get max acts of anarchy. One shot reloads. There's one. There's two. So I'm going to pause the video and I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so we officially are out of ammunition, but this is when the magic happens. If you're trying to stack up your anarchy, don't open, don't take this ammo here. Keep yourself at zero ammo. And I also have this um, shotgun max ammo relic, which I'm hoping will give me extra weight. Or shotgun ammo. Hopefully I can find some more chests that I haven't opened yet, like ammo chests around. Yes, there's some up here. These should be weighted more for shotguns. Right, anything, any other ones? Nope. So I actually end up getting more shotgun ammo back than I sh should. Simply because... I don't pick up this... These two ma uh, chunks right here. Alright, we're at 132. Almost there. See you in a sec. Okay, so we hit 150 stacks. Let's go to the next stage. Let's rock it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Alright, I don't know where we... I've, I don't think I've ever spawned here for a round. This is... If, this is new to me. This might be a, a, a strange bug spawn, or this might be a new spawn. It's kind of nice. This is kind of sick for a picture. Alright, I, I... I mean, there's, there's still enough enemies for me to fight, so I think I'm fine. Got the Ks are out right now. It's decent. 150 stacks. I don't have a way to get more stacks than that right now. And I also don't have close enough to make it kind of worth. So I kind of have to barrel stuff like a little. I think I might do is equip a Jacob's Recoil and Magazine Size Relic. Maybe get a second shot out there. Should increase my DPS and DPM quite high. Quite, quite a good amount. Pow, pow. Now, I have to keep Anarchy mod enabled. And it's set to 100% keep Anarchy on save quit, which you do save quit in Rogue Glance uh, twice. That's outside of your control. Oh, mistakes were made. Um, I don't really have a way to heal juice up unless I have a transfusion. Let's do a homie slag one. Please find some good targets. It's got a zero second fuse. Oh. Still be pretty good for us. Oh, we're dead. The trap just goes away, too. Okay, yep. There's a couple enemies here. There's some transfusions out there. I think I overdid it. We're gonna have to try to... I mean, I'm hoping also the transfusions can kind of soften them up. I'm being honest. I'm almost not gonna save you here. I get in there. Tough enemy, tough enemy. The launcher enemy. Over that transfusion finds something. I have a jack of all trades on right now when I'm using a shotgun. Maybe we should switch the assault rifle. Go. I don't know how worth it is. Right, back it up, back it up. Bad boar right now to shoot through this guy to the, the guy behind him. Alright. More homing slag transfusions. I think I've been sleeping on them a little bit, to be honest. How slow are they really? I mean, th it's already back to me. The zero second fuse. I don't know. I feel like mine's pretty good. Yeah, I don't think I'm supposed to be here. 
it was a very different stage and no red chest right yeah i don't think i was where i was supposed to be all right let's go to the next Okay, this is a fun round. Okay, let's drop my five points into close enough. Hmm. Yeah, close enough. And let's go to our Jacob shotgun and just start spamming. And 54 is the number. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Getting to the initial 150 is just the beginning. We have close enough now. Our shotgun shots don't have to hit. They ricochet. The spitter makes a lot of sense as well. Let's get rid of the Jacob's pistol. Sorry to say it, tell you. If we can get ourselves a quad, that could be pretty sick. <laughs> not reloading is such a tough task sometimes. Honestly. Not for me. I'm not I'm not gonna be reloading. I just changed the key bones. I do like amp shields on gauge. I'll take it. And then I will put it on after I get some blood soak shields going. I tend to reload without Discord. Hmm. Shouldn't. <laughs> then you lose all your stacks. I'm not into losing stacks. All right, double slap. Just remember that it's basically you're just playing like a mage. Playing like a mage. And my combo is my double shot. A pow. You guys are a little bit smaller. I have to aim a little bit better, but they're less dangerous. Just run over there and get them. But I think honestly having anarchy give you some melee damage is actually kind of worth it it does synergize well that rate 41% is actually pretty good I'm looking for I'm looking for a shotgun that can do more damage like a quad or a bushwhack bush gun or a hydra or a tricatra or a twister or anything Been betrayed. Go. Okay, that's gonna be it for the stage. Imagine if I could just look down and 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 get that loot randomizer going. Oh, that loot uh, teleporter going. The fire burst Tesla. It was a long bow fire burst. Actually, it could be really. Uh, a really long fuse though these guys notice it of course they're gonna notice it but Mator. no not really but these guys i'll tag their shields hopefully a little bit fire burst real p is what a doobie is okay i think i'm going to Take some blood soaked shields. I want to be a little bit more versatile. And I think I do want to shoot a mask. How? In there too. Do, 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 do. Oh yes, finally. Oh, let's see. Open accuracy and reload speed. Yes. Or take the or do we take the gun damage? No, I want the accuracy and the reload speed. Oh, uh, sorry for gun damage. Tomorrow letter faster is really nice. 
This one gives me 38% reload speed. It would also give me a chance to slag eventually being worth it. How much percent? 38%? While well, this other one being a rifle gun damage, smart loader faster. Give me how much reload speed? Sixty percent. No. Oh, I see. It's times six. So thirty-six percent. It's two percent less than thirty-eight percent. I'd rather have the accuracy. There we go. More, it's faster reload and better accuracy than the jack of all trades. You're welcome. I do the mathematics. You guys benefit. Crazy. <laughs> oh my gosh. <clears throat> we're not gonna. We're not gonna mess up this jump either. Okay. Do we have a launcher? Do we have something that we can call our own in the launcher spot. Don't think so. Let's grab this. And I've been doing a really, uh, I'm doing a much better job of using the weapon numbers to choose my weapon. Soup. Let's roll. Hey, hey, hey. So just try this bit off just for this, just for a second. I think it could be really good. Some anarchy. Especially if I did a jack of all trades too. See what we can do. That trap, get out here. Shield's gone. Land some crits. Come on, baby. Ow, we're hurting, we're hurting. It's a good fire burst grenade. Be very strong here. Do the heavy lifting, baby. Hmm, let's go. Incendiary Lab Transfusion. Perfect. We'll just do, because it's on the fly, it'll be cooler. Look at, look at the healing. Thanks. Super easy. Alright, so a Jolly Roger. I do like a Jolly Roger. I do. I'm a Jolly Roger enthusiast. Times 18 pellets. 200,000 damage. What's my other shotgun doing? 280,000 damage at 7 pellets. It's better. This one has more DPS. The Jolly Roger has more DPS. It's a matter of anarchy stacking though, right? At the same time. Blast mask is right there. Hey, yeah, what are we thinking? Absorb shields are really nice. I'll take it. Might even put it on. Comes down to a longbow slide transfusion. Even though it is long fuse time, it, it is exactly what I'm looking for. Are you serious? I mean, plus six wires don't talk is good. Idea gun game for horde rounds. Like Borderlands zombies, each round different weapons are purchased off wall. There's a mod actually. Um, shout outs to Steven Wilder in the chat. There's a mod actually that rotates your primary weapon every so odd seconds that you can moderate, or when you press a button that you can moderate as well. I was going to make that video after this one. Then I won't be looting at all. I'll just be using the primary weapon. Okay, increase the maximum number of anarchy stacks you can have. I think I want to take one point in that. One point close enough, because I want more of that. Cooking up trouble is, a, is, is a, an important point. How about a little bit of defense? And a little bit of shield regen. I'm, I'm missing healing, but I, I got a lot of shield to regen going on. That 33% reabsorb shield sounds like a, exactly what I'm looking for. Okay, let's roll the next stage. 
Okay, it's Wilhelm. It's Helmy. What up, homie? Homie, Helmy. It's lagged up. Nothing will survive. Gonna get you. Oh, come on. Give me those crits. Hey, uh, do you wanna. Hey, buck up. Do you wanna buck up my shields, bro? You can use all my grenades. What about your really big shield that I was talking about? Uh, it's not really helping me any right now, to be honest. I should honestly just keep holding on the trigger, right? Doing decent damage. I'm not sure if this is tier three damage, but it's decent tier one damage. I'm down. I'm down to rock any sort of primary weapon that can help me out like this. Is that a loot enemy? I thought I saw a loot enemy. I also want to make sure Wilhelm's loot doesn't fall off the edge. Okay, I live. No, I think it's just the particle effects. You can't fool me. Okay, so Wilhelm's loot looks like it blasted off this direction. Got Iridium, 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 which I'm not against. Because box pulls are a lot of what makes you strong. Legendary. A sticky homing bouncing bonnie. That's not a bad grenade for overall DPS. Okay, now it's time for our ethereal gift box. Come on. Rough rider. A rider that's rough. A skyrocket. Yeah, skyrocket's good. Good for deeps. A pot of gold. I'll take a rough rider for now, but I don't think I'm going to end up using it i'd rather have the absorb absorbness i don't know an overkill and actually has more damage than probably my my big laddie or another spitter purple kind of want to see if it's better stats either way i think it's time to start Investing in our offense a little and get some movement speed out there Still have not taken any healing of all shields usually I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna get my my health engine going as well. Nope forget that I'm all shields Lower my shield the lower my health good. I want low health because that makes my shields come back faster And absorbing rockets from this RPG loader. Holy I like how I can see it too I like How I can see and that happens the shotgun's called what? The Jolly Roger. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a big Jolly Roger guy. Big, big, big Jolly Roger guy. Oh, another RPG loader? Come on now. Where's my absorb chance? 33%? Oh, really a badass. Ultimate badass loader. That's 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 really nice of you to throw me game. Appreciate that. Looks like we're gonna be able to handle it just fine though. Take get rid of this jet loader. Uh, actually no, DPS DPS the big guy. DPS the big guy. I think we're good. I think I think we got this. I can win. Jet loader doesn't get away. There we go. To makes gauge very good. Ability to hit things in the air as well. All right, let's see. There's another overkill. The damage is higher, but this one has a plus six magazine. Cool. Thanks for that trap. Appreciate you finishing off the round for me. Melee damage and override cooldown rate? No. Doesn't really make sense for this character. Get rid of that <laughs> reload indicator. Yeah, and getting the extra accuracy is good. Is good. 
fighting against a little bit, just a little bit of that. Anarchy destroying your, your accuracy. This is a big deal. I want to get that two pressure plate though, because a quad could change the game for us. Right now we're just rocking this shotgun in, in the meantime, but a quad is an end game option. I want to find one. It's not unique. And I'm, and I'm saying that I want one. If I farm every piece of chest in this game, every loot source, and I don't get a quad, and I, I would feel a little bit gypped. Where's the pressure pad on this map? I thought it was down here. I thought it was on top of like a crate over here. Hiding. Hidden from the and it's hidden from the players. I jump up like this. This. Oh, it's so easy nowadays. So easy nowadays. Oh now this is a nice spot. Or pressure pad. Yeah. Okay. No quad, but we keep it we keep it moving, we keep it moving. And we're getting a little bit unlucky. Let's go to Oh, I don't want to do Discord while I howl out the moon. But I will take a little bit of unstoppable force. And then, you know what? <laughs> With one point. Take like a little bit of healing. I, 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 I will bend the knee to the healing gods. You will take, you will take healing. That's what, she, that's what she requires. Will bend. I don't need to increase my stacks quite yet. I'm only at 183. But this is a decent amount of stacks for any weapon, especially shotguns, so... Having fun with it. I don't really get to run shotguns all that much. A big reason why I play Gage is to, you know, run shotguns. Blast him. Ow! There we go. When you get a couple of those shots to land, like it does do pretty nice deeps. My relic isn't really helping out with any of this damage either. Not bad. I haven't seen a rabbit yet. <laughs> okay, no rabbits. No rabbit dabbits. That bad guy goes down with a rip. One, two, ow, don't do that to me. Go. Now I can shoot all the rest of my shots and get my healing going. Wow, look at how, how I've evolved. I right, speed run, speed run. Get all the loot. Uh, uh, uh. I have to go faster. No. Run faster. Do, do, be more picky with loot. Well, thanks. Alright, let's see. Shotgun damage? Sniper rifle damage. Okay, okay. And there are certain snipers in this game that I would I would use as my number ones. Oh. I can get one of those. Maybe... Let's parkour. Don't fall off. Let's parkour. I can make it up there. Don't fall, baby. Yes, we're up. Okay. Do something good. More bandit shotguns. I mean, it's shock. We'll take it, but it's more bandit shotguns. I think one fell in here. There we go. The rock slapper. <laughs> it was hiding from me. Okay. I think that's going to be it for this stage. Let's roll. Man. Nothing really of note. In, in that stage. 
Somehow that's what stage has sometimes how stages go. Okay, a good slagging option. Okay. Let's organize a little bit here. I'm using the Jolly Rogers my primary. Slagging option secondary. Anarchy stacking third. I should be prioritizing anarchy stacking at least a little bit here. I do want to increase my damage output using slag. Remember that even when you don't hit, you hit. You know what I'm saying? I do. Got, I've, I've got to put some points in. Let's do some healing. And let's do. I've cast out Conal class for more chance to. Stack up. We'll be able to see when that happens. Okay. And when we get kills, that trap is out here for longer too, so I'm just showing. Let's see, slag damage. Um I don't know if it is gonna be better. Catch. The shotgun actually does really nice damage. We're kinda ripping. I think uh, applying slag with this launcher isn't as important as just blasting with a really big shot. Oh, you don't want the full force one, brother. Appearance snipers just feel like don't, they're not gonna synergize. There we go. In the heads. In the heads. Always. Okay, let's do a little bit of farming, a little bit of farming. The longbow slide transfusion with the same amount of projectiles, but a, sl uh, a faster fuse. Direct upgrade. Let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Everybody clap your hands, hands. That trap, who are you trying to hit? Who's trying to take that out? Okay, there is a pressure pad somewhere here. I think I remember where it is, yeah. Go. On top of the shrubbery, you will find the pressure pad. Yeah, a doll minigun. Uh, so the doll minigun might actually be something for us because we can use a jack of all trades class mod if we're getting closer to having to fight Pyro Pete or Craw. We're gonna need all the shock we can get. We're gonna need all the friends. Everyone's gonna have to make it. Oh, an anarchist. Let's take that. Let's go ahead and increase the amount of stacks we can get. And some more typecast iconoclast. Then Mylan. Yeah. Then we can start going defense. I mean, honestly, we can. I wanna get to the melee skill too. Oh my gosh. I'm keeping the hardest boss in the game. See ya. All headshots. Go. Very clean. Yeah, there was no headshot there, but. I mean, lots of absorbing, which is what I like. Longbow Corrosive Cloud. That could be very strong. Doing great things, that trap. I'm here to back you up. He's like, yeah, I'll just tank the entire map. You should be really good for this for this portion. He just tanks up everybody. Including Oni, hopefully. You want that trap to tank the boss. How's he doing? He's not doing so hot. He's not doing so hot. How's he doing? He's still doing okay, actually. He's on, he's on cooldown, so he's what we do. Actually, this is this is some next level strats. Got a min max level but here. Cooldown rate plus forty three percent. And do we have a cooldown rate class mod? Let's see what we got. No. We just we just cooldown rate it for a little bit. We chill out. 
if we get some poke damage off just by spamming. Is what it is. This is the strat. My gauge is so cool. I don't even have to interact with you. Once that chef gets set back out here, I'm going to go for some more aggressive plays. And his shield won't come back up. Hold on, right? Let's equip that. I rate and minus minus scene size magazine size isn't so terrible. My death trap is back. I'm just gonna run over here just real quick and swap this out for more damage. I think it could be, that actually could be good for my shotgun. He's getting something like that. I rate and minus magazine size. Good. I hope it behave more like a Jacob shotgun. My bandits are Jacobs. Now I'm out of blammo. Don't worry, I saw it coming. We can slag him up. And we can't bag him up because I didn't bring a, a second weapon that's not a shotgun. Uh. Let's use a anarchist. There we go. A lady fist. I mean, would you look at that? We got a madhouse. I just don't believe in it. But maybe, maybe in the hands of Gage, the madhouse could actually be really, really strong. Jack of all trades class mod. Close enough to get the bullets to go where you want them to. I think maybe. Just maybe. Be honest, something. Right, let's get the last gas can. Boom. Let's keep shooting the lady fist, right? It should help me out. Oh, the lady fist actually isn't going to be accurate enough. Dang. I thought it was gonna. I thought it was gonna be good enough to get me uh, some crits, but okay. it doesn't look like it. Maybe less stacks are required, but I don't know if that's... I don't know if less stacks are part of the plan for me. What I might do... What, what could be what could be cool is, is to take one point in Discord that reloading early is good. Alright, now we go nth degree, then we're chilling. Shoutouts to Ascension in chat. Let's go. Okay, this is where we can... This is where we've collected deaths, though. Oh, yo. Okay. Not that one. Get down carefully. Okay, now we will open up this one carefully. Careful. Get that spitter. Here we go. Okay, it's, it's dragon fight. It's dragon fight. What I might do... There's a couple strategies we can apply. We could... There's definitely the pray for critical strike strategy. But I'm wondering if maybe if rocking something like a madhouse would be funny and good. <laughs> I think it could be funny and good is the thing. And I can put on a jack of all trades class mod. Assault rifle gun damage, magazine side, smaller loader faster, and the better half. Do I have any points in the better half? I do not, but I will. Night. Yeah, we got damage with this thing. A little bit of slaggy lag lag going. Shooting directly at him, the best move? No. Shooting the ground near them. We're doing okay. Let's try this. 
regular Jacobs and see if that does any better for us. Ow. Doesn't look like it. And what's our what's our relic right now? Well that right, we don't need that. Let's do It's just Jacobs for now, yeah. Oh that's all we can do. I mean slag damage. We can do a little bit of slag damage for our for our grenages. And see how this madhouse does against this guy. I was like praying that if I just spam bullets all over the place, that I will kill this guy. I could be getting fiery bonuses right now, but I'm just not. The reload is going to be quick. I destroy those other guys pretty quick. Yeah, this is, this is. I think this is where I want. Maybe I get a little bit of high ground. Is that how she works? A little bit of high ground, shoot down on your enemy. He's getting the high ground now. Getting kind of torched up. Maybe we make it through with the madhouse. Cool. <laughs> we take those, and we get a jolts candy. Let's go. Bandit skin, technical skin, no thanks. Go baby. Oh, legendary. Legendary Mechromancer. Like that. That a lot. That's trap I can't save, bro. Alright, so we are gonna take a point into the better half. And then nth degree. I wanna I wanna be able to slap kitties with my claws. And which is the one that increases my melee damage from me and Death Trap? How do I do that? Uh, is there one that increases me mine and his melee damage? This is the one. All right, let's get Mylan going. I want I want to be able to slap him. I can also use that. I can also use the slap tech to decrease my stacks if I want to. A trespasser is really important. A landscaper? <laughs> I don't think it's gonna be that good. And a buffalo, there's no way I could ever use this. But let's put it on the madhouse and see. Maybe I could. I mean, I got a lot of anarchy stacks, it's a thing. Alright, let's go next. A pretty sick time to get Jolt's Candy, to be honest with you. These miners. Poor laddies. I drop that down. Let's get our token of wealth before it. Go. <laughs> My computer might crash with all the transfusions that we're chucking, but. Jolt's Candy is broken. Whoa. <laughs> it's raining dwarves. That is crazy. I caught that. <laughs> that is so funny. Oh my gosh. Give me all that iridium too. Alright, it's time to hit up the box. And once we hit the box... Oh man, we're going to the moon. Oh, what a shot. Alright, my land for me... Mylan for you. I think the five gorillas is what we do. Let's go, baby. I want to slap. I want to slap a little bit. I want my slaps to be a little bit, a little bit juicy. All right, hit the box once time for the one time, one time. Oh. Okay, it's a peak opener off Ripopotamus Prime. It is. Right, so let's invest in the future a little bit. I I I kind of want another option. Not another option. Box me. Oh, that's an option. 
Okay, do I have any iridium left over? 16. Let's do a Grenache and head out. Peak opener is really, really nice. Especially against this boss. Now, I can't crit him anyway, so there's no reason to use the Trespasser. I think we just hit him with what we got. Everything we got off rip. Yeah, he tags me, but it is what it is. Trying to do as much deep business as I possibly can. It is a quick tier. I am interested in getting up these ammo vendors and spawning more enemies. To fight. Let's do both those things. I'm just taking the, the dot. I guess nothing. Right, so we got some spider ants out here. He's still slagged. I'm, hoping, I'm expecting the spider ants to just to kind of just die over time. I don't think I need to keep Death Trap alive the entire time, but. Right, it is now officially time for me to get my ammo. Slag him up. My ammo chase are already open, though. This already opened them up. As long as this guy doesn't melee me, we are in business. I don't want to farm up some loot spider ants, too. It's a good thing. It's a good place to farm up loot enemies, but he goes down. What do we get? An attack and a shield. That's, that's, gonna, that's our new shield. That's our new shield of the future. Very sick. We have one of our one of our pieces of of our build locked in. Oh, interfacer. Okay. Interface me? No, interface you, brother. Interface you. A Nirvana SMG. It could be fun. Ooh, an actualizer or a Hawkeye? I think an actualizer would be better. Because this, doesn't the actualizer do more damage for body shots? That's kind of all I care about. Right, some kind of just running around like I don't care if I hit a headshot or, or whatever, you know, I got no accuracy anyway Just actualize him Big opener interfacer is going to go places as well And I'm, I'm also a slapper Just sick. All right 92 we're ready. Are we good here? Are we ready to go? Very cool interfacer is is an exceptional shotgun. What kind of grip did I get on it? Jacob's grip, Jacob's stock, blade. It's, that Jacob's. It looks like a Jacob's kind of all around the bear, all all around. Probably could be better. Probably could be worse. All right, let's go. Was it fake? Oh my gosh. Find real butt stallion. Is it you? There's no way they changed it. How could they? It used to be so easy. Now everything is ruined. Real butt stallion. It's not real butt stallion. Where is she? The first time I did it, it was it was pretty heinous, to be honest with you. see you. I see you blinking in the moonlight. Zebra. And the fact that I had to run through a particle, was I thought was a little bit malarkey. I run through a wall. Where is this horse? There are upside down blood stallions on the ceiling. How am I supposed to find... Is it a parkour? Please tell me it's like a super fun parkour. Okay, you, you jump on this butt stallion. Come on. Hmm. Jump on the rock. Gives you access to this branch. Okay. Now what? 
I jump up high? No, I bonk my head. Definitely a head bonking. Bonking my head. Alright, I'm gonna keep looking. I'll see you guys in a second. Oh, we found it. Oh my gosh, finally. Alright, so you run up these stairs. And there's a little, a cute little unicorn chilling right there. Alright, and you jump up. And you slam onto it, and you can go. Let's go. We are moving on. Their anarchy saved. 340 stacks are saved. That is beautiful. All right, we should be good to go here. I've been muted it uh, for a decent chunk of time, but basically uh, all I was saying was this peak opener should be able to carry us. Um, now this is one of the hardest stages. Luckily, the peak opener does explosive and shock, which not very many enemies can resist, so. And it's going to be reloading a decent amount of times. We have enough ammo invested in a hard for us to use because we got it in the first pull of the box. Could you believe it? Let's use this to kind of speed up our clear here and we want to get a, a gauntlet victory. Gage is a fantastic, fantastic user of the Pico opener. Still haven't meleeed a single enemy, I don't think, but this is what it is. Oh, huge. Explosive damage. That's big. 39%. That's huge. Very, very important. Uh, you can get some very cool class mods from this zone. So it's like, it's a, it's a dangerous zone, but there's huge rewards. If you can manage to get some. <laughs> Okay, we keep it moving. The middle tree is what we want. It's, it's what we do here. For sure. I actually don't want shotgun at all. I think it kind of helps. It hurts. It hurts. It makes it me debuffs. They can't see. Then I'm going to go more pep. Hope I, I, I hope I have enough points to get down to this. I don't. I hope I do. We'll see. Okay. But I also want to give an extra shield to... I want to give a copy of my shield to... Death Traps. Like, what do I do? I respect to lose all my anarchy. I'm pretty strong. But I want to get down to Wires Don't Talk is the problem. That increases my shock damage. Which is a multiplicative damage value. See you later, cabin boy. Okay, we're class mods. Here we go. Oh, legendary macromancer. We already got one of those. Wait, two? What? Plus six wires don't talk. That's great. That's the one we're going to want. If we can get to wires don't talk. Is 350 my limit right now? Looks like it. I didn't realize. And as I'm fighting off the, 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 the world's largest sneeze, I just took my medication because you know, I have a cat now. And I'm doing Flonase. A little bit of Flonase once per day. Flonase is a really nice 
uh, medications you can get at <laughs> Walmart. Just take a couple of spritzes up the nose and that's a 24 hour protection. It's been going pretty well. My grandfather uh, got Flonase for me or one time where he had it and he said it worked really well for him. So I started using it and it works really well for me. And I also have those small little bandages that keep up your nose a little bit or open up your nose ways. Those work exceptionally well when it comes to getting sleep. Field capacity matters, but what matters more is getting down the skill tree. More pep. So we officially have one point in wires don't talk. Which immediately makes maybe this better. It's a huge damage increase. Low nades is such a lifesaver, says Lugia. Yeah, I agree. I'm supposed to be allergic to this cat. I'm supposed to be allergic to this cat that I got, but I have been touching it, loving it, and it's been amazing. No symptoms. I mean, a little bit of symptoms, but not really. But my throat doesn't close up because I'm just like overdoing it, but I just can't feel anything. There, kid. Now we're a wired zapper. Guys wants to chase me all the way up here. I don't want to get caught in a situation where their knockback will affect me that much. Keep running forward. Get this guy on the, on the run. And now I can shoot behind me a little bit. Very nice. But we got a legendary over here. A gunner rank. Ah, I can't really use it because... If I do a one-shot reload, I'll lose on my anarchy stack, so. I like it. We're not really running into ammo problems at all, either. Where are all the chests? Here we go. Okay. I will kind of want to jump over to that, but I kind of don't want to at the same time. Are there more chests up here? There should be, right? Drop it a long way for this. Still nothing. Wow. Okay. This is what it is. Let's go next. Push that zone pretty easily. Fires definitely do not talk. Uh, so now we're getting 33% electric damage and now interspersed outburst combined with more pep 20% more chance to slag It's gonna be able to have us slag things a lot more That might be the last point I can get I already have a nukem I don't know if I really want Anything else right now what I need to do is drop reload the nukem though These guys can hurt me I'm nervous about oh, this guy's what he's doing over here Make an argument, and now is a good time to swap to a slag damage relic because of interspersed outburst. But we're doing just fine with what we've got. Yeah, boom puppy. Yeah, this is a basic boom puppy on mega steroids. Aim a little bit low so I can hit more. Here we go. 350 stacks of anarchy and we do get a little bit more points play around with i think that's going to be it and i think that's that's going to be the end we're not going to get best friends forever with the antagonist instead we're going to make it sparkle take opener and then we're going to go we're going to slag uh death trap so slag him up and now he can slag enemies He might turn into shock though, because I'm doing mostly shock. That's gonna be that's gonna be is what it is type of situation. Oh hello, Lily. My cat has entered my uh, my office space. 
come over here if you want to do on pets all right so let's slag them up try to slag up the boss as well there we go very big damage see if my anarchy shots can reach that far they do and we're good to go hi you want pets i love you i love you i'm one shotting I stop petting her. This, this could be the end of my humanity. If, if she decides that she wants more pets and I can't give them to her. Wow, that, that gift box was awful. My turn against this all. Well, she's lying down. She's such a good cat. She's not such a good cat. She lays down with her paws in because she's really cozy, warm. And I brought in her old I brought in her old scratch pad that we that we put next to one of our end tables or attached to one of our end tables So she can have something that smells like her and then she likes to scratch and lay next to whenever uh, around Thought there was somebody there. There's no one there the Sun blocks it guys gets a little bit lucky but it looks like an anarchy shot did hit though. I no longer see guns as guns. Guns are just simply vehicles for anarchy. The peak opener just so happens to be the best. Because I'm not hitting crits anyway. I do not have any sort of auto crit function. Age does not synergize well with crit based weaponry, like zero. Instead, Gage is much more about <laughs> chaos and destruction of a large area. That's why I like Absorb. And that's why the Peak Opener is so good on here. Because you can't, you're not going to be critting anyway. And sometimes you can, but at the end of the day, Jacob Shotgun, Jacob Shotguns can only get you so far with Anarchy stacked when they get this high. Oh, a Texas squad comes in. And it's like, you will will use me best cat ever best cat ever i hope she knows it. i hope she can understand me too oh the nice little launcher do i replace oh man Launchers are, are vying for the number one spot, but this, this Nukem is... Well, it's a Nukem. Victor says she is big, damaged, and AoE. That is right. That is correct. Just like that. Let's do a throw reload. Back to the peak opener. We're fine. We can both pick up a health pack, because this is Borderlands, okay? You don't need health healing nowadays. You're supposed to be shock, or you're supposed to be a uh, slag, brother. There you go. Oh my gosh, and you don't really aim at all. It's great. You do aim? Like, you aim the same amount as other characters do. You just... Look, he switches the shock. You could lock it in. This is what it is, though. I don't mind him being shock. Boom, big slap. Hmm. Give it to him. Oh, give him that work. 507k, half a million on uh on just the electric portion of his attacks. Doesn't seem right. How do I go down there? I was gonna swap to my nuke, that would have been insane. Thank you, Death Trap. Okay, so I think there's something back here. Launcher max ammo, come on. I mean the shotgun max ammo was nice, don't get me wrong. Torg magazine size and Torg accuracy recovery. I mean, it is a Torg assault rifle. I'm not too sure if it's the accuracy recovery that's the problem. Alright, we can head out. Magazine size is something, though. 
Explosive damage is gonna go hard here. Let's actually up to our explosive damage. Sorry to the to the Torg Allegiance one. Any big lads? Yeah, there's a big lad. Good night. The and, and the dragons? The dragons are small. But Death Trap can bring down any dragon. He can just zap them. He will zap them. He'll bring them down. Too much uncontrollably. I can't I don't really have ways to stop him from doing it. Then my job is to finish them off. My, he's like, I'll start the fight and he'll tank as well. He has no problems tanking up. Death Trap is that dude, you know? It's sad. It, it was sad when they, they killed him in one of the games, right? They let Death Trap get killed. It was like, oh, but I repaired him. He's back now, which I get, which is cool. But now he's like, I don't know. Uh, they're just doing too much with Gage's character. Gage's character was cool, and then it became not so cool. Darth Maul effect, you know. Uh, I personally, like, every time they keep adding Darth Maul. Oh. Brick wall now. Very interesting. Why the brick wall? What was there before? There's a bushwhack, but we already got ourselves a quad. Don't necessarily need anything of that nature. Uh, to Sawtooth Cauldron we go. Hey, hey, ho, ho. To Sawtooth Cauldron we go. Oh my gosh, the quad is insane. See ya. Not having antagonists on... On Death Trap is a decision to make if we're using shock weapons, right? So, Firestone Talk is, an, is a really big damage increase if you're already, you know, very strong. Right, if your anarchy is already up there and you're using shock damage weapons, getting that shock going, a shock uh, percent weapon bonus damage gives you so much more than any per any gun damage would. In BL3, I think she was fine for what I saw. Oh, okay, yeah, I mean, being a wedding planner instead of like a really cool, kind of badass vault hunter, I don't know. Not my cup of joe. Not my tempo. Who's behind me? Oh, you. Yeah, I'm gonna die, actually. I can kill him. Here we go. I'm 344 stacks. Oh, no. I have law and order. I could go melee. I have law and order. I could go melee. Made of stunner stuff and strength of five gorillas. I could totally do it. Dealing damage based on the number of anarchy stacks you currently have and restoring health. All right, let's go for more anarchy stacks. Oh, I can't. 350 is max for me. Let's say I can totally see this working. Totally see this working. Lily my, has not left my side yet. <clears throat> so this laying down next to me on the ground. All right, this should be a good matchup for me. Hopefully we get slagged from the shot here. Don't think we did. We ignore. I don't think she's in a chance in this fight, to be honest. Hoping to get a. I mean, after after losing so many rounds in a row, right? Salvador and Krieg. Kind of want to get Gage like. I kind of want her to help reset, you know? I'm still missing a core element to this build, which is like a Norfleet. My first ever Roguelands win was Norfleet. Gage. This boss is pretty simple. <clears throat> There's so many enemies to, to kill. That makes Death Trap so much easier to keep up and running. He soaks damage. 
the more enemies we kill, the more chances we have at loot enemies. We actually do want to be DPSing them as fast as we can. Which is a really cool mechanic that only exists in this game. <clears throat> Ouch, we go down, but... I'll say a record would tell that we probably won't be staying down. There we go. Should be it. Nice. Alright. Did you drop anything good? You got the purple weapon. You dropped some iridium. We have ourselves a Mopey's candy, but it's not going to matter. Alright. Pop this. Sheriff's badge. Now that's something very useful. Very, very useful. Okay, um... We'll hold off on the Mopey's candy. It is a horde round next round. Maybe Mopey's could be good. <clears throat> I have my Jacob shotgun out because if... If fake chest shows up, I'm going to blast it in the face. Okay, melee damage second would help. We're gonna keep it moving and just moving. This used to be a chest though, right? I wonder if there's an Easter egg or something. Turn over here and get this candy. You like it? Oh, it's not. Oh yes, it is, it is. Good night. How many enemies can I kill to one shot? All of them? The ricochets, look at it. Um. Let's go. Alright, so let's get our token of wealth. Then get our loot looticles. Circle of loot. Our sniper rifle damage we take. Hmm. Is that a rifle max ammo? 73%? That's not bad. Going to a raid boss fight is probably what we want to start with, to be honest. That is do. Dang, incendiary damage? That's tough. I swapped out my quad. <laughs> Bring it on back. Excess quad. That's sick. Pretty nice bazooka. In order to be my class mod now, you have to be really strong. I don't think these are. Alright, this one didn't get opened. This is the miracle one. Nope. Okay, let's roll. Got options. I feel strong. They're gonna hit box up. We're going for the gusto at this point. There's a North Fleet. It's a slag North Fleet. It's gonna be great. Absolutely phenomenal for us. A slag North Fleet. And we can buff it up with slag damage. And a hellfire, sure. But what we can do now is invest in launcher max ammo. And grenades, I guess. And one more hit at the box. Yes. Very cool. Anti-affection and electric chair. Those are two grenades that I definitely want. Let's empty out my backpack. Getting a little bit too full. The greens and below. Gone. I kind of probably, I probably want that relic back. It's probably, yeah, it's gone forever. All right, go. The Wham Bam Island. Okay, we have a decent matchup against her with the opener, not necessarily the North Fleet. Let's go explosive damage. Storm front, I kind of like the electric chair better. I think it's, it's just straight up better. Bring some water for the water fight. Get this job done. <clears throat> yep, we're going to be just fine here. Look at that. 350 anarchy stacks. And I thought my crane might crash, but it's good. It lives. It lives. 
Fire in random directions. Here we go. Croc should be back soon. There he is. Like how I can hit him from anywhere, just because it doesn't really matter. There's only like one or two have to hit, right? Is that what's happening? You don't have to hit a lot of shots. I don't have any life steal though right now. I'm hoping to get a grog nozzle or something. Okay, let's get the electric chairs going. I have increased shock damage, so all all types of shock damage are good for me. Okay, here we go. Should be the end. Oh, one more invisibility phase. Immunity phase. Later. And the peak opener is actually really nice on gauge for another reason as I don't die here obviously for another reason And that reason is Because I get movement speed on kill I can actually reposition and not blow myself up a lot of the time like if, I, if I get a kill I can move really really quick That gives me much better opportunities, you know to Open up another DPS window without having to worry about putting myself down. Okay, let's toss him a couple extra chairs from distance. That trap is back. There we go. Let me drop a mag. Loot him up, up, up. Loot him up, up, up. Yeah, this would be a nice time to have that. All loot, teleport loot in front of me. Rubber I slide crossfire. That's really good for like a, a creek, something or other. I mean, we could still use it. I would kind of just rather have what I got now. All right, an infection or a slag actualizer. I mean, a shock actualizer. Let's use shock actualizer. Do I have a launcher max ammo relic? And how about an amp shield? Start with an, we start amping a little bit. We have a launcher max ammo relic. We don't. So I'm gonna go straight. I'm just gonna go for slag damage instead. And we can just go north fleet. I was hoping to get maybe a Logan's gun, and oh, here we go, a sludge shotgun. I, I'm I'm a fan of the shotgun of sludges. I'm a fan. I'm gonna come into I'm not. Alright, so for the purples, I think I can just dish them all. There we go. Clean them out. Clean them out, baby. Okay, so. Got my quad. Got my slag. Got my peak opener. Got my north fleet. Should have we set up for, for monumentous success? The only dragon that I'd be worried about now, it would be the, the slag one. I can get them all down to the ground with my North Fleet. And also, I don't want to die to myself. That's going to be a big thing. Gotta be careful. I can I can lessen my anarchy if I, if I have to. Yeah. Go. Oh. Anarchy fleeting for the win. Alright, jump me. One or two or three. So far, the Anarchy Keep mod has been working, which is amazing. I jumped too soon. Wow, go back to the beginning, they said. Back to the start. I wish I could sprint and do this. By jumping on the crisscrosses. Alright, to tier three. Go. Alright, we kept our anarchy, which is nice. It's very, very large. 
At this chest, and we got one around the corner. Legendary. More Macromancer legendaries. Fires don't talk. It, it is okay, but it's not what I'm looking for. My current class mod is what? A six fires don't talk, and top stats are, are not the best, but I'm still doing so much damage with it. If I wanted to north late around, maybe I shouldn't use this. Should instead use. Can have trouble in the better half. Sure. Let's see how we do. Good night. I can drop reload as well if I, if I want to. Make sure we shoot it far away from me. Here we go. Fire. As long as it gets close, it'll do the job. That's what I like about it. Upper load. Catch. As long as I do not hit myself. Just keep shooting it from distance. Find enemies, shoot it from distance. Boom, baby. This is how you... This is how you fleet around. Blast him. Boom. Yes. I right, almost had a blammo. I'll put you on a melee. Or I kind of want to get some ammo regen going. Night. But it looks like we had enough ammo for the stage. And we can we can look around for, for more launcher ammo. Here we go. We got through the stage with it. Launcher ammo, please. As I open up everything. No launcher and blammo. A big boom blaster would be a pretty nice get. Here we go. Launcher. We can reload it. I think the bonus accuracy is actually quite nice for my for my action skill. That's for sure. We got here. Weapon accuracy, reload speed, the better have cooking up trouble. It's basically the same one I got now. Gun damage minus weapon accuracy. I don't think I want that. I don't think I want that at all. Up here. Now we are in tier three now, which means the the pressure plates become incredibly strong. I want to go find one, and I don't remember exactly where it is in this stage, so I'm going to go look. I'll be back in a second. I think we're just going to go ahead and move along. So just, just take this Juso's candy and use it in the, in the next stage. A oh, huge stage get Juso's candy. Huge stage. There we go. Huge. Run. Flat. Thank you. Wipes and swipes. Slaps and slaps. Rock columns go down. There we go. And how many... Okay, now that it's gone, how much melee damage do I actually do? Yeah, not worth it. We gotta back up a little bit here. I think open air is just gonna be... It's, it'll be fine. While I'm saving up my ammo. My launcher. Okay, again, here you can definitely get class mods, so... I wanna... Be checking it out. Trevor, what do you got? Captain Blades, auto idle. No thanks. It do be cursed. No fleet? <laughs> no. Looks like it, but it does not. You think? Oh, class mods. Here we go. Come on. Okay, reload speed and fire rate. That sounds pretty good. Critical hit damage and weapon accuracy. Reload speed and fire rate. Critical hit damage and magnet size. That sounds good, too. Plus plus five wires don't talk. Plus six wires don't talk. Reload speed and fire rate. Pretty versatile. Very strong. Okay, I had a good necromancer. 
Do we get more mobbing here? Yeah, I know where the pressure plate is on this map. Blast them. Hey, Chuck, can you go out there and tank for me, please? Fine, you don't want to? I'm doing everything myself. Here we go. I'm debating if the fire rate is, is worse than the weapon accuracy, but I don't think it is. It's still better. Even if I'm not really using it on the North Fleet. Did the drop reload this? Oh, we're good. Alright, blast him. Really simple, really effective. Yeah, there we go. We're clean. Right, a hail or a hail? Uh, um, I think a fire hail for the slag dragon might be kind of good. We get no more points. Let's keep moving. I blast him. Even the big sleep can't withstand the power of the North Fleet. Yeah, I think these dragons are in trouble. <laughs> the enemies just got evaporated. Now, what I would like a top now. Let's shoot some shovels real quick. Like, I still have an enemy to shoot. Okay. I would like is a top now, so let's drop a little this. Drop to my bandit. Shoot some shovels. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Shovel, shovel, shovel. I think they moved it out here or something. But they moved the shovel too. It's not the same place it was. It's, it's right here. Top near. Oh, it's a slag top near though. I was hoping to knock it. Hoping for a fire top near. <laughs> In any other case, I would love it, but not this time. Yeah, let's head out. Three, two, one. Hey, Joel Stu responded to me. He said, he said, look up at the tree branches. <laughs> oh my gosh. Too funny. Yeah, we did, we eventually did find it. We did find it. All right, so uh, slag and doc don't really work against this boss. Uh, but you know what does? Fire. So... Do have anything for SMGs or fire or anything for that at all? <laughs> of everything I've collected? No. That's fine. Silver slag damage cares. Maybe maybe the it'll be good enough. I could always just swap over to a my peak opener and use explosive damage. To win the day. Yeah, so it looks like we did have a game crash. We had a really fun run, though. We got to run around with the North Fleet. I think that we would have had the dragons if we had got a chance to get there, but the gauntlet lives on. That being said, that's my second time in a row now that a crash has impacted the end of the game. I do have a lot of mods installed. I could clear house a little bit and, and work on that for the next time. But anyways, thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed, hit the like button. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!